ones could tend to get blocked yeah. after a little while, so it's good to make sure that they're clear and there's enough solder on them. And at the same time that there's no excess, because taking a solder blob out of this is going to be... Yeah. It's harder. These are loaded all on this side, and the board is already broken up. And it will, as you would expect, find the neutrals. how it crashes here, it should stop. <laughs> but it's doing very good, it won't fall off. Very nice. And here I'd like to have a visual even though I, I trust that it'll it'll line yep. things up, but I don't want to trust it too much. Five five minutes and a half and we'll be on the other end. So it does the different um, profiles like based on where it is in the in the machine. Yes. So there's yeah. three there's three heating zones and you can see them on the screen. Uh, yeah. And what we want to get is a is the right curve, the ramp up speed, yeah. the liquidus, the time that it's molten, and the cool down can't be too fast either, other otherwise there are micro cracks also in the, in the yeah. solder. 